guys, George here, and today I've got about 8 minutes of Modern Warfare 2. I do quite well in this game, I'm running Aria, Pavlo, and AC-130, not using the nuke, because I normally go for them, and, uh, oh, I got like something stuck in my throat there, and uh, I normally go for them, and I don't, I don't know, a lot of, you've seen a lot of nukes on this game, so it's not exactly like, you know, uh, you need to see more. And the game's like, what, 5 years old now? I can't believe this game's 5 years old. It's weird that this is a five-year-old Call of Duty, and yet it's still, in my opinion, the best one. I mean, if you take out the one-man army danger close noob tubes, like, I just got killed by there, then this game is, like, a freaking boss. It's just so good. But what I wanted to talk about today was, um, well, I don't really have, like, a huge thing in mind. Like, I mean, normally I go into a commentary and I, I have a little brainstorm. I say a brainstorm. I have a little think before in a couple of minutes, and I think, you know, what could I talk about? And I was going to do the the usual thing, which is Advanced Warfare, because obviously every single YouTuber to do with Call of Duty is talking about that at the minute and their thoughts on it. But to be honest, I don't really give a shit about their thoughts on it. Um, all I care about is the cool ideas that people have. And some people have had some really cool ideas, like the perk system should be based around those suits uh, so that you enhance your suit to do better stuff and things like that. But to be honest, I, I don't really care i don't think you should care either about my opinions on it and uh I, i'm not offended by that at all because i personally didn't you know i don't give a shit what fucking big youtubers think about it it doesn't bother me all i care about is when the game's gonna come out and leaked info and stuff and uh, dan did a video yesterday actually on the time of recording this i don't know when it's gonna be uploaded but he did a video saying uh, leaked advanced warfare thing <laughs> and it's one of those stupid uh, montage parodies although i say one of those stupid ones i've only made one but they're really funny you should go check it out i'll leave it in a link or i'll leave it as the previous video link in the thing but um anyway yeah i don't really want to talk about advanced warfare too much purely because everyone's talking about it and a lot of people think the same and i will briefly put it into perspective it's a move that they have to make or duty is stale at the minute and they have to make it different whether it's going to be good or not i don't know uh, but it's a big risk and Activision wins either way because if it isn't good they you know well that it, if it isn't good everyone's still fucking bought it and if it is good they're gonna get all the praise not Sledgehammer for having faith in Sledgehammer to make their own Call of Duty so it's stupid bit of a fail on the Claymore death there I don't know how I didn't see that watching it back but um, yeah strange I'm just like going off with the AA-12 in this I mean I didn't used to like the AA-12 but I don't know what my problem was with it, because it's a freaking good gun. I mean, it's like, it's probably the shortest range shotgun, but in terms of it, uh, that short range, look at it go. I mean, it is, it is the best. It's, it's a pro thing. It's like, I don't know, it's a strange gun. I don't know what I was double tapping. I don't know how I didn't see that guy. But I do uh, quite well in this. I think I get, I only get like the one AC-130, but I should have got one where I died a minute ago, but I didn't, because I didn't camp it enough. And uh, it's my own fault. And then I robbed someone's pred missile. Look at this. This guy throws an uh, airdrop down and he doesn't even go from straight away. He's just... I could have took, took the stealth bomber if I was quick enough, but I wasn't. He comes and robs it from me like the last second. Look at this. Look how close that was. I probably would have failed of it anyway. I'm not very good with stealth bombers. I don't know why anyone would ever use one over a Pavlo when they're both nine kill streaks. If it was like a seven kill streak, I might use it, but there's literally no need because it's just freaking. It's just not as good, to put it bluntly. But. Uh, as I said, you know, not much to talk about. It's good gameplay. I was really proud of it, purely because I don't play Call of Duty like this, especially Modern Warfare 2. I am someone who goes for nukes. I go for the nukes all the time. I'm not going to lie. I sweat my ass off. I don't really, because I don't find them that hard to get anymore, but I always used to. But I find it pretty damn, you know, fun to just go for nukes all the time, so that's what I do. I very rarely play with other kill streaks because I don't see the point. It doesn't... Uh, in I don't enjoy it as much. I couldn't get the words out then. I didn't know what the word was. It doesn't entertain me as much. Look at that wall bang there. No FMJ, just stabbing through the wall. I mean, you can anyway, because it's only like wood, but you get what I mean. And I actually did, I've already recorded this commentary like once, but I, all I did was talk about Advanced Warfare, and I, I don't know, I didn't find it enjoyable. Like, as I said, what's the point? It's, uh, it's going to happen. Trailer looks good, that's all I'm going to say. Looks quite fun. And uh, I'll actually, okay, I'll talk about the rule that we've had at this one game, and I, I didn't want to say this, but we made a rule... This is something that should probably stay private, but I'm going to say it anyway. I'm actually just going to talk about this little ballerina spin that I did with this guy. I don't know what that was about there. We had a little dance, and I managed to kill him. But we made a new thing where uh, we decided, I say we, it was... Well, yeah, I'm going to say we, actually. I'm not going to put names into it. But we decided that uh, we weren't making videos to our maximum potential, and we weren't doing what we wanted to be doing enough. Like, 
when we started the channel, we set out to entertain in any way possible, whether that be by funny videos, commentaries like this, you know, really good gameplays, just anything. But we set out to entertain, and we we knew we weren't really doing that. So, uh, as you just quickly go off on a bit of a tangent, I, I'm so bad in AC 130s. I've had loads of them, but I just suck absolute dick at them. So bad. I've never been very good at them. I don't know why. I'm way better in a chopper gunner. Much prefer it. But. So we've had a thing where each member is going to be involved in or directly making and uploading a couple of videos a month, uh, minimum. And obviously there's going to be exceptions, like we're not dicks to each other, but we've made that sort of rule because we feel that if there's no pressure on us, we're not going to do it. Look at that triple kill before I die, beautiful. But we feel if there's no pressure on us, then we're not going to do it enough and we're not going to make the content to our full potential. So what it should be is 12 videos... Uh, a month minimum so that is one every couple of days or one every three days really or two or three and that's minimum so at the rate we're going it should be one every day or one every two days and I much prefer that I think that is a much much like more efficient way of doing it and um, we all agreed that that's the best way to do it because as I said the channel has been going almost a year now it's been doing 11 months I mean it's our birthday is in June 14th the channel's birthday so we wanted, and you know, we've been going a year, but admittedly we haven't been at full strength for a year at all. We're still not even at full strength now in terms of everyone being able to record and stuff. But we wanted to do, you know, we had in our in our minds like a certain set of not like rules, but a certain set of like ambitions and goals. And I don't mean like to get a certain amount of subscribers or views or stuff. I just mean a certain like thing that we would always do it to entertain, and we wouldn't do it for you know all, all the wrong reasons and stuff. And we kind of haven't done that enough like if that makes sense so I don't think it's worth it or it hasn't been at the minute and we want to make sure that we change that purely because you know we're not necessarily having as much fun doing it as we should be doing and uh, now we've started doing it I can say you know I can say I should have got that third guy then that was really bad I can say I'm having a lot more fun and I'm enjoying myself a lot more but we're sort of coming to the end of the commentary now so as I do usually I'll start to wrap things up and I'll try not to repeat myself in the outro like I always do Look at that guy, whack down his TI and just gift me the kill there. What a what a tad. I mean, I don't know why, well, he wasn't a tad. He didn't see me come around the corner. But anyway, guys, thank you for bearing with me through this commentary. It's been a bit of a weird one. I'm, I'm pretty damn tired, actually, to be honest. But I have been George from Swan Gaming. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for more from us. Be looking forward to a lot more content in the future. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.